Uh, yeah. Okay. So now we're on Chofei We have we have quite the daf tonight on Amabez. It's quite. Uh, uh, yeah. So basically, so tonight, so I always forget to say the preview of the daf. So, um, um, so we're talking about that islandess. If a guy marries an islandess, and she is, and he's he's at her. Um, if he's chayshed her, so then he uh, um, he doesn't. She doesn't drink the drink. Why? Because she never had the ability to have a baby. Since she never had the ability to have a baby, she's not allowed to drink the drink. So we have this long brisa that, that that goes through all these different women that could drink, can't drink. At the end of the day, the end of the brisa, it says an island is you could give her to drink. So that's so that's what the is kash. And the say it's a machlekes tanoi. Then the Gemara goes through all the different scenarios of different couples that are that where she does drink and she doesn't drink. And then it's the Mishnah that said Ahmed Bezis basically that the Mishnah had said that if she, the husband, was makana her, that she was sleeping with a katan, so that since a katan's bia is not a bia, so then that's not called kini and stira. And it said somebody who's not an ish. So the Gemara is going to go through, what does it mean not an ish? The Gemara is how it maybe means a guy, maybe it means a guy who's not a man, meaning he doesn't have, he, he cannot have, uh, he doesn't have koyak gavra, as they call in Lush and Naki. Um, um, and then we'll and then we say maybe it's an animal. So Gemara goes through all that. Okay, so so let's see. So again, so the Gemara had left off that an islandist doesn't drink. Oh, right? yeah. Can I ask you something from yesterday's daf, Yaakov? Yeah, yeah. Because I, I was learning uh, uh, that the the man they when they give skila, so they hang the man up naked, and the lady they don't. Right. Uh, they have, they, she wears clothes. With, but you, we, you said already a few times in the past few weeks about the man has the same hilchas sneers as a lady, pretty much. So, what, what if it's a busha for lady? Why isn't a busha for man? Well, I thought it's more, it's more of a, well, I don't know, bechlal the women's. It's not more, it's not more mavuish for a woman being just than a man. I'm, I'm, that's what I think also, but I'm saying in the halacha, in the halacha side of it, you said the tznius is the same. No, oh, you're saying, oh, it's, yeah, the tznius is the same, but this, I don't think it's a din in tznius, it's a din in the busha, no? No, okay. That's what, that's why I understood it, I could be I'm wrong, could be I'm wrong, but that's, uh, that's why I understood it, that it's, it's oh. more of the busha for the woman. Or, or maybe for the for the priestess of everybody else, but it really was Xerus Acosta, wasn't it? Wasn't it? I just think a, so. I think so. It's just a dich. So there, he could take yeah. our longest and throw it out the window. It's a pasuk that says that uh, whatever the pasuk was. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So anyway, so we said that an islandist because it says the nix of Nizra Zera. So she does not. So an islandist, at least the Gemara is thinking now, the islandist does not drink the drink. So basically, three lines up in the bottom. On mem chafeyam beis meisve hamakana lo rusasu the shemeras yavam shaloi. So somebody who's makana the white the girl he's engaged to, or to the woman waiting for yibum. Right. So this was in our mishnah two blad ago or three blad ago. Ziyam actually konsa nistera. So if she before they got married, I mean before they did nisuin, she was saisa. She was she went into a room alone with this guy. Loy shayis beloy natal suvasa. She doesn't drink the drink. Because we said it based on the pasuk of Tachas Isha, she has to be under her husband, which she's not, because they're only engaged, and she doesn't get her ksuba either, right? On to Aleph now, Muberes Chaveroi. That we said yeah, again. Sorry, is she still zokuk to Yivum? Is she still zokuk to Yivum? Yeah, why not? Right, so I mean, still... you think she gets out? Of, she's I mean, she's going to need. I mean, you, you're going to have to do chalitza. That's what you're saying. Uh, or 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 go to a different brother. Go go to a brother who's not Makana, you know. <laughs> right. Yeah. So yeah, you really. Uh, um. Yes, that's. Maybe, or you go to a different brother. Yeah, that would be an eitzah if there's if there's another brother. Yeah. Okay. Muberes chaveroi umenekas chaveroi. So if a woman's pregnant from. His friend, and she's nursing from his friend. That's obviously not what that means. Again, this is a repeat of what we had 
that, meaning she was pregnant and then her husband died, right? Or she was nursing when her husband died. So the din is, she's not allowed to get married for two years till the baby's two years old. So she wasn't allowed to get married. So she got married. And then the guy got jealous of her because she was hanging out with guys. So then, so she doesn't drink, she doesn't get a ksuba. A person is not allowed to marry a woman who's pregnant or nursing from, not from his child, from his friend's child. And if they do get married, they have to get divorced and they're, not, they're never allowed to get married again. So since they're never allowed to get married again, there's no, and, and like we said in the Mishnah, any time that the marriage is not allowed, there's no drinking of the soita water. There's no drinking of it because the marriage is not allowed to be married anyways. Right? But Chachamim Yoytzi, Chachamim say, no, they have, to, they have to get divorced. And after the baby turns two, he could marry her again. So since he could marry her again, so therefore she could drink. Right? Because this is not somebody who's also to him for La'ayla. This is a woman that could be uh, muttered to him, or will, will be muttered to him eventually, right? Fine. So that's, uh, so that's that case. Now, we know practically, Bismanazer, we didn't discuss it last time, we think we discussed it in Yavamas. It's a big shayla, Bismanazer, that we have formula, right? Shulchan Aruch discusses where you can give the baby eggs and milk, and the baby will survive. This whole thing is because we're afraid the baby's not going to survive, Right? So nowadays that we have formula, does this, does this halacha still apply? Does it not apply? Um, yeah. So, I mean, the pashtas is it still applies, but there, there are makilim when it's not so common, this, this situation. But uh, yeah. Okay. Fine. Then the next case is v'haroiva. I don't know if it's roiva, roive, right? Rashi says a bacher, right? A bacher, meaning somebody who's young enough to be, out, to be able to have kids. Shenasa akara v'skena. He marries somebody who's an akara, meaning she can't have kids, or as a kena, or she's old, vain, meaning she can't have kids. Vain la'ishu b'anu me'ikara. And he doesn't have any other wife or children. So meaning he has a chi of pru revu. Right? So lo'i shay suv lo'i natal k'subasa. Since he's not allowed to stay married to her, so he doesn't drink and he doesn't take the k'suba. That's the Tanakama. Rebbe Lazar, I mean, why? Why does he? Why can't he stay married to her? Yochel Lisa Acheres. He can go marry somebody else. Meaning, in addition to this wife, this is obviously talking about before the Chen Rebbe Gershon. The Lifros for Lirbo Semana, and then he could have kids from that. So why? Why can't she drink the drink? Right? Why can't she drink the drink? He could just marry somebody else. Okay, so that's the Machloek is Tanakama Rebbe Lazar. Whether whether you can say that he can marry somebody else, fine. Aval. But if somebody is Makana, his the, the girl he's engaged to, or the girl he's supposed to do even to, Nistara, and then meaning he warned her when they were engaged, or when they were waiting for you. Then they got married and had Yibam. Then she went and was alone. Right? So the stira happened once they were married. Then she either drinks or she doesn't take ksuba, meaning she has to drink because this, the kinoi could happen when they're engaged. As long as the stira happened once they're married, then it's uh, then that's fine. But let's say she's pregnant or she's nursing from him, not from him, meaning it's his own child. So since it's his own child, so then either she has to drink or she doesn't take the ksuba. Haroiva and uh, somebody who's the Bachar, Shanasa Akaru's Kena. He married uh, an Akara or somebody who's too old to have kids, Vyeshla Ishubana, and he has a wife and kids. So in that case, she either drinks or she doesn't take uh, the Ksuba. Now, this is Lachair according to both Shitas, right? Even according to Nakama before, who said that she doesn't drink. Even because the Tanakhama didn't say, didn't go with that he can go marry somebody else. But here, when he was already married to somebody else and had kids, even the Tanakhama, Lachara, would be Maida that she can drink the drink because he's already, he can stay married to her because he already has kids. He's Makai approvable, right? Fine. Then the last ones is the main part of the, what the whole point of this price is. It's just Mamza Lamamza, 
So let's say you have the wife of a mamzer to a mamzer, right? Two mamzerim, that's what happens, right? A mamzer can only marry mamzeres. And now they get jealous of each other, right? Well, the man gets jealous of her. The isha, not feishas, nosin, lenosin, or a nosin married to, to a nosin. Feishas ger, ve'evin reshukra. Or somebody whose wife was a ger, or, or I'm sorry, he's a ger, or an evid, he's an evid that was freed, who automatically also becomes a ger. So then they also do regular standard saita, the islandess and an islandess. Aisha, so all of those, Aisha, Isa, not the Ksubasa, either they drink or they don't take the Ksuba. So what's his last case? Right? So the last case is islandess. So an islandess either drinks or takes the Ksuba. So you see from this Brisa very clearly that an islandess could drink the Saita water. And we finished saying, we got finished saying on Amid Bays, the previous Amid, that an islandess does not drink the water. So Katani Mia, islandess, it says islandess. After this whole Brisa, it says an island is does drink to you to the Rav Nachman. So it's a kasha, it's shlugs up Rav Nachman. Right? So Amr Lach Rav Nachman. Uh, so Rav Nachman. What? Tanayi. Yeah. Who? Sorry. Tanayi. I read it. Sorry, I had read Tanoyi. it. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. yeah. No, so it's Tanayi. Right. Um, so yeah, we have to get back to one, one thing. So Amr Lach Rav Nachman Tanayi. It's a machlekes tanaiva. No, the Amri ki hatana the Tanya, and I go with the Tanya that says Reb Shimon ben Elazar Aimer Islandist loy shoyse of loy not this ksubasa. An Islandist doesn't drink and doesn't take the ksuba. She never v'nixa v'nizra zara. She's gonna if she's clean, then she'll have children. Misha dark alazria. That's somebody who has the derech to have to have zara to have kids. Yotza sazu shein dark alazria. This is not her derech to have kids because she's an Islandist. She's an Islandist from birth, right? Okay, and the Rabbonon disagree with that, and they hold that an islandist could. Okay, so Rabbonon, Haiva Nixav, and Isra, Zera, Maya, Abdullah. So, what are the Rabbonon who hold that an islandist does drink the site of water? What do they do with this pasif? So, if I look at the Tanya, of Nixav, and Isra, Zara, that she's clean, and she, if she's clean, and then she is, and she'll have children, Shimhai Sa Akara, and Nifkadis, that if she, becomes, if she was an Akara, then she will become Nifkedes, like Rashem Pakar Esara, right? That Hashem will remember her and she'll become pregnant. Dear Rabbi Kiva. That's Amr Rabbi Shmuel. Rabbi Shmuel said to him, Imkain Yisasru Kolha Akaras, Yifkedu. Then every Akara, what she should do is be alone and with a man in a room, right? We discussed this a couple of times, right? We had asked the question. We didn't know that it was Gemara Levite, unfortunately, right? But, uh, Right, let every akara be alone with the guy, drink the drink, and then she'll she'll be healed. Vizu high of alignness to have seen. You're talking about one of the shlosh shaber chumurus. No, what? Not, what? No, they just no. Yichud. It's not. It's it's just yichud. We're not asking her to sleep with him. If he sleeps with him, then she's certainly not going to get pregnant. She's going to blow up. I understand, but she, she, she saying, just ticks off her husband. She doesn't tick off her husband. Is this a derisive? It's not a derisive. What should what 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 do you? First of all, it doesn't have to be a derisive. Akiva was asking this the other night. It doesn't have to be a derisive. You could. There are sheetas that say that she could be alone with the guy. It doesn't have to be an isser yichud. The maximum isser that it is that it would be is an isser yichud. So basically, Yosef brings a raya from Chama. Well, couldn't have been an Is it derisive or not? It's, if they would be meyachid, yes. Zev, yes, Zev, it. excuse me, Zev. What what are they Adam saying Adis on? Well, what are they saying Adis? Well, by Saita? This case, yeah, yeah. that she was Saita. That she was Saita. That she was Saita with him. The, what, is Saisa, I mean. what does Saita mean? That she said, when Yichud with him. She went into a room with a man. Maybe there's a kid there, just like the way Cooper's need. Them. You're right. Maybe, you're her, right. Little, I, maybe her little sister's in the room beforehand, and they, nobody sees her. Right, so the same so, so, so. Um, it's the lacha. You, you, listen, if it's an isur yichud, some some mafarshim ask like what you're saying, Zev, that how can you say that a woman should go be over an isur darai? The mitzvah baba avera. That's what you're asking, Zev. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there are those that say that ask that kasha because they say you can be over an isur yichud, but but others say you don't. Know, is, is it 
Mitzvah Baba Aver. Is it an Aver of the Rabbanon? Is it a Dereifa? What is it? Theoretically, it could be it's a It's a smart move. I would call it a smart move. <laughs> <laughs> the Vesei Yosef brings a Raya from Chama. Pasuk says by Chama, Lifnei Bala. The Estatra Lifnei Bala. Labali. That that Bala Ba'ir. Yichud's not an Isser. So she, that's what she was saying she was doing. She would be Sicer with her Bala Ba'ir. Well. No Isser at all. Correct. So that okay. So that's an eight and then it's not right. meaning it's not a, it's not going to be an isid daraisa. It's going to be you're still, be causing, you're still causing Hashem's name to be wiped out. Nobody nobody should purposely cause Hashem's name to be wiped out. Oh, so now now I'll keep you asking me a question. How far do you go in order to to be matter a woman that she should be able to have children? How far do you go? Right. It seems go very the far. And Rachas that the, 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 the Gershon is saying is that would be that we would go that far. Correct. Yeah, that's 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 well, no, because Gershon is saying that you can do the. She could be alone with this guy, and it's not an iser yichud. You can do that. It doesn't have to be an iser, right? Meaning, let's say she's alone with the guy in the house, but she keeps all the windows open, the front door unlocked. So the husband says to her. Husband says to her, I'm ticked off at you. Right? You shouldn't have done that. And I want him now. You got to drink the drink. That's it. So she has to drink the drink. She was alone with the guy. Right? She says, fine, I'm happy to drink it. That's what she says. That was that was her tachlis. That's what she did it for. In order yeah. that he should be Makana her and she should drink it willingly and uh have a nice day. <clears throat> you know, yeah. yeah, no, that's that. Listen, I I want her to share from an uh, from a big uh, a big big uh, rub who was not so to have kids, and he said he had an older rub, and he said that in the old days, forty years ago, nobody was mattering IVF, nobody was mattering it. Everybody everybody was asking. Good Reb Moshe had his head, to, but the island was signing with the Samar rub. All the Paiskim did not allow it, and he said, and now. We now everybody does not even a shayla. Now he's not even a shayla. He said this was his yisoy. He said that society at some point requires things that we have to we have to be maker. We have to we have to push it to be maker. Right. So I, again, hey, don't try that at home alone. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, don't don't. Uh, but uh, that's what he. That was the rule that he said. So a person today. It's, it's Yaakov. You know, what about um, Lifneiver? Is she putting him into a situation, the guy that she's being Yachai with? Is she putting him into a situation of Lifneiver? Um, <laughs> she, buys him a big of ice. she buys him a bag of ice chips. Don't yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. You see, you know, it's a good question. Is he putting him in the Lifneiver? But no, you see, if you do it in a situation, you'd see where, where the window shades are open and the doors open. No, there's still if naiva. You still have that possibility. There's still you're putting yourself into that situation. No, that doesn't matter. What's neighbors are not being to drink is her husband, right. not the guy who's in the room. See, but Yitzi, they're really gonna have right. all these video cameras and seeing everything. It's obviously nothing happening. But this her husband with her husband is Mekana, and that's Gairam her to drink. Not the, right. the fact that the, they're miyaka together. You just have, you're saying you just have to trick the husband. The husband just has to think something's going on. Meaning, meaning look, <laughs> I guess true. you said he goes in the front door, the man, and she tells him, okay, just go right out the back door. Right. <laughs> right? And now like this, she'll be him. I don't know. Maybe, <laughs> that's what Rafa is saying. Maybe that's the Eitzah. Maybe that's the Eitzah. But you, the point is you want she wants to drink the drink. Either way, so so that's Ruby Shmuel's time. He says, if that's the case, um, Where all the aligners go, and, 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 and right, so it's right. So that's all. So what, Taka? So what's wrong? Well, let's say Taka. So Rabbi Shmuel says, "Zu hayo b'loy nistera hefsida." But this woman, who behaves herself, she's going to lose out, right? So, so Mamela, he's saying that you can't. It can't possibly be that that's the taich and the pasuk that every woman who has. Uh, any woman, every woman who has stira is going to automatically have a kid. It can't be that. 
which is Why? interesting. What, what's wrong with that? What? What's wrong with that? Because then he says, is this, then, is uh, this time that we should teach them to do this? Uh, no. Is this, but the, the way Rashi explains it, if you have a woman who is a straight arrow, who's not going to do this shtick, she's going to lose out. And it doesn't make sense that somebody okay. who doesn't want to shtick, who doesn't want to do shtick is going to lose out. That's such a big was a straight arrow. Yeah, yeah it is a big China. We're teaching her a loophole. If you do the wrong thing, then you get then you can have a kid. No. But if you do the right thing, you can't have a kid. No, no. That's yes, that's exactly what Rashi says. Bazu call Isha Tsnua Akara Mishum Deloy Nisterov said any Isha Tsnua who is an Akara because she's Tsnua, she's not going to have kids, and that's not fair. I don't know. It's a very hard thing to understand. That's it. I mean, I don't want to throw in the Hashem part that if they're supposed to have what, a kid, they're going to have a kid, and if they're not, they're what, not. Uh, what about, what are you talking about? I don't yeah. want to throw that in there. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Yeah. What are you saying, Ramon? What about those of us who sell chametz, who sell and sell mashka versus the and, yeah. ones who don't? Right. So what right. do they do? So, I mean, I don't know what your brothers who, who come more Hashem drink. <laughs> I don't know what they do. It's not my business what they do. But maybe one of them is throwing away $1,000 worth of schnapps every place. Maybe. And I'm, I'm selling it. To, I'm selling it to their brother. Who's selling it to a shake for me, and they're throwing it in the garbage. So they lose. So why don't you have the same time? Right. So, the, so, so a, look, this is a head the head answer head. is the head 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 to, to sell chametz. That's the it's difference. The head head to sell chametz, no. Good, so but I had a plastic about you not selling chametz. That would be the difference. No, but this is not a head there. This no. is the I understand, thing. but the Gemara's question is how could you say the Torah sanctioned it? Why not? Tyra often aren't sanctioned it. That's what the Gemara's question is. Why can't the Torah say that? The tire is going to say that that oh Isha Tznua gets messed over, or everyone else doesn't get messed if over. That's a, if that's a fact. That's a fact. What what, what, what are you supposed to do? Right? It's it. not a fact. The, you the know what? The, 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 the are learning the sugya like this. This is the way it comes out in the sugya. So that's what you do. No. You know when this comes up. You know when this comes up. I hate to bring it to a contemporary, less serious issue, but you got people that ask Ashila. My whole class is cheating on an online test. The whole class is cheating. If I don't cheat. I'm not going to do as well as them. Right? So that's a tznua. That's a tznua who doesn't want to cheat. So what do you tell them? What do you tell them? Sorry, uh, you have there's, to there's cheat. There's yashras, and you know, you tell them that you're not supposed to do it. Good. So yeah, that's one the second. yashras so, involved. Okay, so one second. So this lady's going to come to you and say, listen, I really want a kid. I'm going to go be meyachid. If she doesn't use the eitzah with going in the front door and out the back door, right? But I want to be meyachid. And uh, should I do this iser or not? That's really what Zev was asking, Batson. Right? You're telling I don't. First of all, we're not telling them to do this. If they do this, it's okay. The Torah doesn't say to do it. it does. the it's, well, it's, telling the you, it's telling you the nix of a nizra. You got yeah, in the bracha. Okay, After you've know. done everything wrong, then this will happen if it wasn't so wrong. Yeah. Not and B, yeah, okay. we, do, we do have the Parshish Kisaitan in the Tyrant. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. It, it's a hard it's a hard thing to understand. Rabbi Shmuel, isn't Rabbi Shmuel the one who disagreed and said that her schusim don't work for her either? Meaning the lady who has schusim and she drinks, that wasn't Rabbi Shmuel? Right? Meaning if the woman has, was that Rabbi Shimon? Was Rabbi Shimon? Ah, I was close with the letters. <laughs> There's another thing by, by Chana is uh, Chana it was a Havamina and she ended up getting a bracha from Elia Koin. So right. so so the bracha is what was Garam. Let everybody go to a Kohen Gadol and get a bracha. You don't have to do this, uh, but the, but well, you know, but the. That's you know, your Right. <laughs> yeah. According according to uh, according to. Akiva, she, she was overlift naiva to, to him. And no, was, that, that he, was she was overlift naiva and he was high and then it she still, still worked. She was it dominant. still worked. It's, it's in Vayag got, FM. You got, got, Shmuel, got Shmuel and Novi out of that deal. <laughs> Yeah. He, uh, the, 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 the part that he was Chayshim B'Kshayim on was not the Yichud part. It was the fact that she was davening and he, he thought well, she was Whatever was, was Chayshim B'Kshayim, right. not giving whatever. How did she know he was even there? Why? What did that have to do with Liv Yeah. 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 Um, um, yeah. 
Okay. I don't know. I don't, it's a hard thing to understand. But then there's a bigger kasha on this next terrace. Im Kane. Okay, so now according to Rabbi Shmuel, what does the Pasuk mean? That if she is clean, she's going to have kids. Im Kane, ma tam alem rabbi nix of So now what does it mean? So he says, Rabbi Shmuel, shim hai so yeledes bitzar, that if she had previous births with pain, yeledes bereva, she's going to be, she's going to have birth with bereva, easy. Nekevas yeledes charim. If she is, she had girls, she's going to have boys. Kitsarim, we clear another example where boys is clearly better than girls. Kitsarim, yeledes aruchim. If she's going to have short kids, she's going to have long kids. Shchirim, if she has dark kids, I don't think I can say it's. <laughs> if she has a shocher, then lechayra she was mezana. No, okay, but that's it, <laughs> right? That was, so, that, that was that was no, no, there's no. a case. Easy. There's a case. Too easy, right? Not at all. Not at all. There's a case of the girl Sora Brown from from the from Netherlands from the Netherlands, and she wrote a book of that black Hasidic lady, and uh, you know it goes back. They had to go back three, four. Generations or so, her, her great grandmother was uh, Belza, yeah, uh, whatever. But anyway, whatever it is, there is a and uh, you know, you, you had uh, darker skinned, uh, you, uh here. No, that's what you have, you have to say that it was a dark skin versus so it was a shocher, so then he's gonna have light complexion, okay. So then, but you have a kasha, Tosis has a pasha to kasha of Yishmael. So why wouldn't a woman, I'm saying for an easy childbirth, wouldn't a woman go be sizer herself? I mean, it's better than epidural, easier than an epidural, right? Everybody's doing epidurals. What, I mean, I don't know if it's easier, but I'm saying, right? If a woman says, I'm fed up with having girls, I want a boy. Okay, so we got to push a date to be Rabbi Shmuel. Say, just go be meyachid with the lady, make your husband jealous. Man with a man, make your husband jealous, and that's it, right? That's Tyson's cash. Like, what, what is this help? According to Rabbi Shmuel, Elamai, it doesn't, it's not, maybe it's not as strong, right? That's L'chayr, what you have to say. That it's not as, meaning you're not going to have so many uh, participants in a Zash shtick just to have a baby boy over a baby girl. Right? But you're going to have a shtick, you're going to have this shtick. Is that what the Gemara is? But you'll have this shtick I, <laughs> if, she does, if she doesn't have children. For that much, Rabbi Shmuel's Chayshid, you're going to, that every woman will do it. But not in order to have tall kids or to have boys instead of girls. That, that, that uh, not. That not. Right? Yeah. Um, say, if we had a base of English today, and this was a possibility, I would say with women, with women and in our society today, we're all messed up in the head. I would say this Shiloh would come back up. You know, my, you know, a hundred years ago, we're happy with girls. A hundred years ago, we're happy with short babies or long, whatever. Yeah. You, know, you know, but today, you know, like well, Rachman, you, 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 like, you and the other Kahalim on the Shia could make a few bucks. You know, you give, you don't give them an appointment unless they there's ten G's on the table. You know. <laughs> I listen. I heard that there's five. Are you selling your short at ten G's? I'm well, I'm, I'm okay. I I heard that the five, there's five women in Passaic, single woman who just had kids. With IVF, I don't know if that number is true or not true, but I know it's becoming more, and it's going to become more and more. They're not getting married. They're not getting all the single girls now are freezing their eggs. Any girl that gets a little older, whatever eggs they have, they freeze it like this. If they get married in their late forties, they could still have kids. Okay, Baruch Hashem. That's a like we were saying before. Hashem creates, creates. Uh, you know, but uh, but a lot. But the chashash is that they're going to get fed up with not finding a guy, and then they're just going to go pay for some zero from a sperm bank. And they're going to have kids without being married. So I heard a few. I heard the number five. And to say, I don't know if that's true or not true. Right? But uh, but it is becoming. There are places that I'm answering. What's the answer? The Ramayisha says it's okay. I'm saying, you don't know how far you're going to get. Right? Okay. Um, now, another thing. Just time I've said it over before. But I once had this Shiloh with Rav Nata Greenblatt since it was his yard site this week. So when there was once an Arab Yom Kippur. So a couple was doing IVF. And they asked them, you want to, it's the first child, you want a boy or a girl? So they call me up, it's like two hours before Yom Kippur. So they started to ask me before Yom Kippur, what's supposed to do, boy or a girl? I said, what should I tell you? The Gemara's always talking about having a boy. I can't call all the big rabbis now an hour before Yom Kippur and ask them this. I said, I think that every Gemara says try and have a boy. So you have your option, so have a boy. 
So then on Yom Kippur, so that's what I told him. And then I went to Yom Kippur, Rav Nata Davin the Shayosh. I went to Rav Nata after Musaf. I asked him, says, ah, love Dafka. I was like, oh, wonderful. <laughs> when I talk about this, goes back to the beginning of the Daf. You got to have Shemus. You can't ask him on your own. You got to have Shemus. Did he say Nata, why? Did he say why? He didn't say why. He, he didn't. I tried to push him. I'm not a pushing guy. So I tried to push him, like, why not? I said, the Gemara says you're supposed to daven for a boy. You have Gemaras here. It says you're going to, you have to. You know, you have a boy. I didn't, I didn't reference this Gemara on Saita, but, and he just said, no, he's like, love Dafka, love Dafka. Okay. He what was else? a big balmadactic. Mestama he taught Bas Kaidim Simen Yafa Lebanon in a way that you have a daughter first, Simen Yafa, that you will have fun. I hear, maybe, maybe he didn't say that to me as far as I remember. Okay. Anyways, Vaita. So a very interesting daf here. And Mama Bez is maybe more interesting. Fine. Aishas Mamza La Mamza. So, this, also, this next line is also interesting. So if a, a mamzer is married to a mamzer, so they, she still does the drink. So Gemara says, Pshita, it's Pasha. I mean, a mamzer is a regular yid, right? right? We had in uh, Sefer HaChinuch on Shabbos, we said a mamzer is mechuyif to, <laughs> as weird as it is, a mamzer is mechuyif to have kibbut ha'vayim. Go figure why, I don't know. But well, he, he, has has to to. Put, he has to keep Shabbos, he has to put on... He's, got, he's a regular yid. I have yid. to learn. He has to shake Lula and Esro. He has to right, he's got everything. Lula. He's right, just so not what, allowed to ma ma marry a... Uh, uh, right, he's got to marry a Mamzeris. So. He's got to marry a Mamzeris, but he can make her drink. Yeah. Right? He's got to put... So the so Gemara says, Pshita, why not? He's a Yid. Mao, the same Fushi, Psul, and Loi Leifush. This is just a... Uh, um, this is just an explanation into what the Gemara, what the Torah is trying to do with Saita. What would you think that to add more Psul into the world, we don't want to add? Meaning... If they stay married, what's this whole thing of Saita about? Shalom Bayes, keeping them married. So if he's jealous of her, so why don't we just say you can't drink and get divorced and finished? Because why would we want more Mamzerim in the world? Right? Elamai, it doesn't make a difference. Kamash Malan, that no, we don't, even if it's going to make more Mamzerim in the world, we still, give her, we still give her the drink. But meaning we see from this that the whole point of the Saita is to make it that it takes away all the svekas. It takes away all the doubt that the husband had about his wife. And now they can go back to living a regular, mar regular, normal married life and have children, right? So maybe, so again, that's the Havamina, that the moms are, maybe we don't want them to stay together. Kamash that we do. Kamash that we do. Fine. Eishas ger ve'evin meshuch revailinus. So pshita, the Gemara says, Pasha, why? Because, uh, why shouldn't you, why, just because it's ger ve'evin meshuch Mao, the same with Daber al Bnei Yisrael, Veloy Geirim. It says, in the beginning of the parsha, it says, speak to the Bnei Yisrael. So that means Veloy Geirim, Kamash Malon, that Geirim are part of it. So the Gemara says, Veema Hachanami. Why don't we say, Taka, that the Geirim are not part of it? So the Gemara says, Veomarta, Ribu Yehu. The word Veomarta is a Ribu, which we had two blad ago, that the word Veomarta, for whatever reason, includes something, which Bar Hashem. This Taisus is Givaldic because Taisus says, Viomarta Tema, Vahafikte Lael, the Rabbis Harusa, the Shemeras Yom Lakini. We used, we already used this Viomarta once before to include an engaged girl, the Shemeras Yom, that they could be Kinu. So we already used Viomarta, right? So, and Taisus doesn't answer it. So, meaning the same kashas we have with the Drushas, like how come you're darshaning two times out of this word and this other word you can't dash, you could dash, and Taisus is bothered by the same thing. Fine. Okay. Aisha's Kayan Shaisa. So the wife of a Kayan drinks. So the says, Pshita, why shouldn't the wife of a Kayan drink? Right? Meaning what? A, a wife, because she's the Kayan's wife. If she was the Kayan becomes jealous of her, she shouldn't, she shouldn't drink. So Gmar says, No, Mat Mao, the same of the he loin nispasa. She was not forced, right? Meaning, let's let's just say the, the background, which we all know, but a woman, a woman only becomes also to her husband if she was forced. I'm sorry, if she was voluntary. If she was forced, if she was forced, she's mutter, except by a Kayan. If a Kayan's wife was raped, then she's now allowed to stay married to him, right? So the Pasuk says, by the by being Mazana, it says, Vihila in the she was not forced, Asura, right? So if she wasn't forced, she's also to go to her husband, Han Nisbasa, Muteris, Mashma, that if she was forced, then she's mutter, Bazu. And this woman, since she was, meaning the wife of the Kayan, 
since she did it, um, um, if she was forced, then she would be Asa. So maybe she shouldn't drink. Meaning, a Yisrael voluntary is the same as a wife of a Kayan forced, right? In both cases, they have to get divorced, right? So Mamela maybe would think that since the wife of a Kayan, even if she's forced, meaning even if she's raped, she has to get divorced. So Mamela, she's not in this whole Parsha, it, right? Because she, she, uh, so because she's she's out because she would be have to get divorced even if she's forced. I mean, the Pusik differentiates between whether she was forced or not forced, and a Kayan doesn't have that. So Mamela, since a Kayan doesn't have that, so maybe they're out of the whole drinking Kamash Malon, that the Pasuk's telling you that no, that even though it's much stricter for a, for an Aisha's Kayan, and there's no differentiation between forced and not forced, still she does, she drinks the drink. Maybe right? she didn't have, maybe she didn't have a beer with this guy. Maybe no, she thinks she did and she didn't. She, that's you, true, that's true, but no, because, no, because since the Pasuk, Differentiates between forced and not forced. So to be chlau, it doesn't make a difference whether she had to be or not, because we're going to see this more on base also. It doesn't make a difference that whether she did have, she did have the whole steer the whole concept of of drinking is out for them. Even though meaning it has nothing. We'll see it. We'll get. I think, and I hopefully you get a little clear on the base. What the meaning? It's not not about what happened. It's about that what theoretically. It's if it could not have happened or it could have happened, then it then it, it knocks you out from the whole parsha, right? Uh, let's see. Um, labayla, and she becomes mutter to her bal. So we right pshita. I mean, uh, if if she didn't do it, she's so she, she's mutter to her bal. So I'm Ravuna. Ravuna says, but must not know. It's talking about where she starts. Uh, um, what do you call it? Decaying. She starts decaying. Right, even though, even then, even though she starts decaying, she's mutter to her husband. So, more ask, what does that mean? It's Navna, but Guamaya. If if she's decaying, right, um, then that means that she was wrong, <laughs> right? She did it. If she starts decaying, she did it. So, how does her husband stay with her? Right? Again, the Gemara is saying that the if she if she drinks, and and then she becomes mutter to her husband. So what I'm saying is Tosh it. She says, no, it's all about where she starts decaying. So if she starts decaying, that means that she was guilty. So how does she go to her husband? So what it says, but Bisnavna Derech Varim. It's all about where her body starts breaking down, but not her stomach and her thighs, which is where the where the blow up is supposed to happen, like we learned in the mission a few blood ago. The blowing up is supposed to happen, start first with the thighs, we said, because that's where the man touches on his way, right? And then the stomach. So it's supposed to start, the punishment's supposed to start with there. And then it leads to the rest of the body. But here, the rest of her body is decaying, not the stomach. So Mao, the same Zanai. So you could think that maybe she was Mazana. But the reason why the water is not working in its regular way is Mishom the Ba'ina Zanai. Because she was, it was the it was under, it was uh, she was raped. Ulagabi Kayan Asira, and if and she would be if she was married to a kind, she would be also. So Kamash Malon, that we're not going to be worried about that. And even if she was raped, she he could stay married to her. Meaning, basically, what it's saying is that there was a stira, right? And then she was raped by the guy. So Lamaisa, even though she's not getting the Sadekas of the Year award, not by a far cry, but the end of the day, the Maisa happened. Bainus. So since she's somewhere in the middle there, since she was promiscuous, at least she was getting there. And then at the end of the day, it was a rape. So Mamela, she partially decays. But at the end of the day, since she was not, since she was raped and it wasn't Baratzen, she's allowed to stay married. That, that's essentially what the Gemara is saying. Right? So why is she breaking down? She's mutter to her husband. Yeah. She's mutter to her husband, so she did nothing wrong. Well, she did do something wrong because she had a relationship with this guy. Even though she the mice of beer... She, she didn't do any mice that, that, that requires her that she should break down. What? She what? She did? She was miyachet with him? Yeah, because she was miyachet with him. Okay, so for that she has to break down? 
Yeah, that's what it's saying. That's what it's saying. I, I say mean, anybody's miyach with somebody, she's going to break down. She no, had fear, no, fear of Bosa. She just didn't do the mice to be that. Well, then we don't know exactly what went on, but that's a possibility, right? Right? I mean, isn't this, Jeff, isn't this what goes on in all these relationships? You have all these relationships with all these celebrities and this and that. He says it was voluntary. She says it was rape. Right? What happened was, is that, I don't know, whatever exactly went on when it came to do the mice, she said stop. He said no. And Zag is on. So she said it's rape. Right? I don't know if that's a dimmion or not, but that's the way I thought. That's no, and in halacha, but in halacha, how does it play out? And Khanami, I think in halacha, if the mice of beer was ba'inus, then it's an ayin, then it's an ayin. I think, I think from this Gemara, it's clear that she's going to have some, some form of guilt. There's no way to prove that. That's why we do that. Exactly. That is exactly the problem with all these cases. It's impossible to prove. But if she's breaking down, that means, that means something then she should be answered to her husband. No, because no, because she's not breaking down in the regular way. If she broke down through her stomach... Why is she breaking thought, down? Because something happened, correct? Correct, but it, the Misa didn't happen. The, the actual Misa Bia was through an Inus, not through, not voluntary. So Mamela, she's not... Uh, there's uh, no way. That's why we do this whole thing of Saita. Because there's no way to really prove what really happened there. Right. And Hanami, that's it. Right. Yeah, right. Exactly. The Saita, the Rabbani Shalom is passing. What happened there? Correct. So if the Rabbani Shalom is passing, what does it mean? The Rabbani Shalom is passing that he, he only did hear of Basra, but he didn't do the Maisabia. So the Mela. Correct. They so, did a Maisabia, just not, not voluntary. Yeah. And if not was voluntary. Caught, so and if it's not, client, and she'd be so awesome. somebody over there didn't do it voluntary, so therefore she's breaking down. Yes. Right. Um, I hope he's never on my jury. <laughs> okay, very good. Fine. Well, there may yeah. be another way to, to, to say it, is that the, the, the partial site is to figure out if something happens. Maybe she says, I'll figure out if something happens for you. When it comes down to what happens, this is what we have. The Rabbani Shalom knows what the Rabbani Shalom knows what happened. The Rabbani is telling the world that you, is this if you do it, these are the consequences. That that's a the Rabbani Shalom knows. What, what do you right. that, That's how he's testing it. The, the Parsha site is for if something happens. She's saying nothing happened. My husband thinks something did happen. So you drink. Right. Here in this case, you're saying tonight. something did happen. You're drinking, you're <laughs> drinking. For what? You drink? What are you laughing? Let's see. Parrots want to know if we're only doing an omelet tonight. I'm sorry. Okay. No, 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 no. That's not just you. It's not, this is a. I mean, don't get me wrong. This is extremely entertaining, and I got my kids all sitting here with the ears. Parrots, parrots. I'm you know, asking you. Still got parrots, I'm blocked. Our parents, I'm asking for mechila beforehand. Take <laughs> another two drinks. <laughs> parents. Too late. Um, Too late. Parents. <laughs> parents. I'm already way past that. Parents. Ahmed Aleph, Ahmed Aleph is tame than what's coming on on Ahmed Bay's. All right. So, okay. Back on, it's, just, it's 920, though. That's on Earth. Okay. That's we're moving. Saying. We're moving. That's it. We're moving. Aisha Saris Shaisa. Uh -oh. And Aisha Saris. I listen. I also thought I was going to hit the 930 mile. I gave up on that one. All right. So Aisha Saris Shaisa. So the, how do you? Well. How do, now based on what what Gershon enlightened me with, which was good. So how do you stem this with Lo Bishamayim he? Yeah, I, I how, do you, uh, how do you? How, how does this whole thing work? Right, and David was saying that what happened? Why don't we Simachan Shamayim that she should have a kid? Why are we doing Chanami? <laughs> yeah, yeah that, how does it go with Torah Lo Bishamayim? That's Tamakash on Saifa. That's right. not, I realize yeah. now, one Gershon yeah. said that. that yeah. What does that mean, Siakov? There's there's an Indian of Misa Bidesh Shemayim. They should all back in the Torah. Why no, do you but that's only somebody, that's, that's, no, because that you're paskin on. That you're paskin on. That, I don't know if they, I don't know if I Bezden, heard, Bezden, I heard, I heard, Bezden, No, no, no. That's the Bezdin Paskins that it's a, Bezdin Paskins that there's a Misa Bidesh Shemayim. That's what Bezdin's they, doing here by Saita. No, Bezdin's not over here. No, she's drinking. That's all. She's drinking. Yeah, drink. She's drinking, and whatever happens afterwards, we did our but, part. What does that mean? That's true. It's but that's actually the same thing. 
It's a straight nace. It's though. not close to being the same thing. Is that what the is here is, is, is to rely on the word of Hashem. Uh, I, I, did I miss something here? Okay, I don't know that. We can dis- we'll have another time to do. discuss this. We'll have to discuss this a different time. Now we got other stuff. <laughs> yeah. Okay, my turn. I'll have to get up and time. find another bottle. We're all going to be in trouble. <laughs> Ish Asha Saras Shaisa. So the wife of a Saras drinks, right? A Saras is a guy who can't have kids. Pshita, right? So it's Pashit. Why should a why should a woman <coughs> drink if her husband um is what do you call it? How do you call it? Sterile. Mao the same with Balade Ishe Khamarachmana. So what you might think that the Torah says that she she slept with somebody, me balade ishe, who's not her husband. By la bar he's not a bar hochi, right? He's he can't he can't have because he's a saris, so he can't have regular relations. So Mela, he's not considered her husband. Kamash Milan, that she is consider that he is considered her husband, even though he's he can't have a beer. Is it the stress right. that he doesn't have the aver, or is the stress that he took a medicine and he, they can't give uh, like What's the chilek? Who cares? He's a Swiss. So. Oh, no, because it can make a difference, parrots. because can he have a beer? Can he have a beer? He just has no zera. Right. Or can he not even have a beer? Which we're going we're to get to that on number base. It sounds like from Rashi here. And if somebody's wearing something that, that there is no zera coming, going into her, that makes a difference? No. Still a beer. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Well, it's not gonna. Well, yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's uh, it could it could make a difference, but no. But the shail is, is there a mice be here or not? Right. Um, but the thing is, it has the reason why it has to be is because somebody who has no aver and it's crushed is not allowed to ma- get married. Not allowed to get married. Yeah. Right. So Mamela, um. Uh, so it be, has to be, be the same Indian. Would that not have a din of Saita? If somebody, if somebody Taka got married, I don't know. I mean, what would be Lamaisa? You can't be Makaima, you can't be Makaima, yeah, yeah. Um, meaning would yeah. that be calling that same Achlaikas tonight? Could be, I wonder, I wonder, Taka, I don't know. Um, meaning this Brown. guy, this guy is jealous of somebody else, or he's he's jealous of somebody else. Okay, Rashi here, the one, the Sris that we're talking about right here, as the most that's coming up on Amar Beis, is that as Rashi says it's called a Sris Chama, meaning he has he has everything. It's not it's not messed up. He just doesn't have the zero, right? On Amar Beis, we're going to get to at least according to one shot that he doesn't even have the he doesn't even have. Okay, so let, he's not a bar. He's not a husband. He doesn't have the ability to be a husband. He could be a husband. He just can't be. Yeah, but to be a husband in in intimacy, he can't be. Why is so the intimacy? Like, why is intimacy the, the 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 whole thing of the marriage? Diana Khanami. It's I, I I don't know. I don't know that that was the thought that maybe he can't be a full husband. So Mamela, right? Uh, well, the other part of the pasuk is v'shakav ish oisa shikvazera. So if that can't right. happen by the right. husband. So, okay, so that we're gonna get to. That's coming up next. That's coming up next. Right. Okay, right. Al Yidei, first we start with Al Yidei Kol Arayas Makna, meaning he could be jealous of all types of Arayas, meaning she, he could be jealous of the father being together with the daughter or siblings or anything, anything with sugar like that, which is strange because then how do you have Yichud? Because she is mutter to be meyachid with her father. Right. So he's going to say, I know. I'm jealous. I, I'm jealous of you and your father. Don't go to don't go visit your father. Which we had cases like that with the husband Taka Asid for the go with father. Okay, whatever. I they colorized Maknim Shita on the base. Now it's Pashat. So Mao the same and Nitma Nit Nit Mao the same and Nitma Nitma Shnei Pa'amim. Since it says the word Tuma twice, Ach Echad Lebal Vechad Leboyel, which we know means that if she Taka was Mazana, she's also to her husband. She's also also to the Boyel. So let's say she theoretically would have become also with the Zos, meaning she really did it. But meaning it's she has to have the ability to become usher to the person she was Mazana with. Meaning she was mutter. And the reason why she became usher is because she was promiscuous with him. Avalha, but if if she was Mazana with her father or her brother or her kid or whatever, since they were usher in the first place. So you would think that that's not part of the whole Kinnun Stira. Kamash Malan, 
that, that the Gemara is telling you know that it is Kenyan steer. See, that's the same Rabbi. It's saying like, it's yes, she's maybe going to be Mizana with her father, not Mizana with her father, maybe she was out, but, but since the whole Kinoi happened with somebody who was also to be with her, so as a technical point, we'll say she's not in the whole parsha. We thought, we thought, Gamash Malon is that we're saying that, yeah, fine. Okay, Chutzman HaKot, and then the Gemara says, except for a Kot. Why? Because Isham Rahman of Eloi Katan. The Torah says he's jealous that she's going to be together with a man and not a cotton. Okay, but then there's the next word in the Mishnah's Vishaina Ish. Right? What, what does it mean? Something that's not a man. So Lamute Mai, what's that coming to exclude? That if he was jealous of her, not being being with something who's not a man. Ilam Lamute Shachov. If it's coming to exclude a man who is a Shachov. Now, Shachov is. The way Rashi understands it, Rashi says his basar is like decayed. The basar of the aver is decayed, right? And it has no koyach, bein by koyach, meaning he cannot even have any sort of kishu. He cannot even have any sort of erection, right? Now he still has he still has an aver because if he didn't have an aver, like we said on the bottom of Ralph, he can't get married, right? So somewhere where he has an aver, but something happened to it that he can't have proper relations. So maybe that's what it means. He's not a man, right? Farmer Shmuel, but it can't be because Shmuel says shachov. If you have somebody who's a shachov, maknin al yodai, you can, you can do kinu, right? Um, meaning, um, if the guy that she's that he's chayshin her for being with is a shachov, that's still enough, even though he can't even have a beer, right? But it's but still a concern. Upaisel betruma. And if she's a Bas Koyin, and she was Mazana with this guy, she would be also to eat Truma. Those two go hand in hand. So therefore, you see Shmuel says, Beferish, that this person, the She'ena Ish, cannot be talking about a man who's not an Ish. So the Gemara asks, Maknan al Yodoy Pshita. Well, why wouldn't you be able to do Kinoi? Right? If, uh, um, if, if he's Chayshid, that she's together. Right? Meaning, so they have to say that they if he can't get an erection, so what kind of kinu is there? Right? Elamai, he can get some form of erection, but just nothing, nothing major. That's how you have to learn the pshat. Right? At least according to Rashi. Either way, so when it says shachav is ish oisa, it has to be with shachav zera. He does not have zera. Kamash Malan. That it doesn't have to have zera as long as there could be some form of a bia, some emela, he can be jealous of her, and that's it. Okay, well, Okay, so a guy he sleeps with a baskayan, this guy who has an aver that's messed up, right? So it's pushing. Why wouldn't he ask her for meeting truma? The same zaroi Don't be machal his his zaroi the isle zera luchal. That's somewhere where you have to have zera to be machal. Right, the less lay zera loich lichal, but somebody who doesn't have zera is not going to be mechal the woman from eating truma kamash malon. So that's what it tells us that no, that that will even a guy whose aver doesn't work is still going to make the woman puzzle from truma. Okay, so the bottom line is we have no idea what the mission when so, the mission says b'sheena ish. We have no idea what the mission is talking about yet. What are you saying? I'm just thinking what Parrot said before that I was starting up with him, but, but intercourse with a with a condom, so that would be that's intercourse, even though that, even though the right? boss is not talking the boss. Yeah. Oh, so there is a sheet in Tysus and Megillah. Um, uh, that with a condom, Taka won't make it. Uh -huh. Okay. Taka, we don't pass it like that's meaning that's the way they 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 answer that that Esther was Mizana with Achashvera, she was with a condom. Okay. But okay, whatever. That's a whole another sugi. Okay, Bella. So must so so we're saying maybe Shaina Ish is talking about a guy. Maybe it's coming to exclude a guy, meaning if the husband is jealous that his wife is being together with a guy. Right? But that can't be. An we do kinui with a guy. And and he'll pass a bas kayan. If he's if a guy sleeps with a bas kayan, she can no longer eat truma. Right, Maknan al Yoda. So, so you see the Fairish that it can't be because we do kino. So, you want to even ask Maknan al Yoda, it's Why wouldn't you have kino with that the husband thinks that his wife is 
is being together with a guy. Mao, the same nitma nitma shtei pamim. No, it's like we said before, maybe it says nitma twice. Echel lebal ve echel lebayal. Right? So the, if she was promiscuous, so then the husband who comes also and the, and the boyfriend, whoever, the, the, the guy becomes also. Hechel de kemitzer bahaz nos. That's only when they become also to each other with this nos. Aval ha, but with a guy, hail vasur vakaima, since she was always also to this guy, whether she slept with him or not, she's also a maloi. Maybe that's not part of Kinoi, Kamash Malon. So that tells us, that we're telling us now that there still is Kinoi, right? Um, and I, I, I don't, before Gershon says this, but I'm, I'm going to jump in before he says it, that it says, Vizerma Susim Zermosim, right? The Zera of a guy is considered like a horse. So maybe that's not considered like a ish. The Gemara, I don't know if the Gemara means that or not, but if Gershon, you were going to say it, I jumped you. Okay, right. She really, has, she really has to get Benji Brofman as her attorney to do that. Yeah, 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 yes, <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, so she, and if, if she sleeps with a guy, she's possible to the same old Baskai and Kisiel is Zora Marachmana. It says a Baskai and what she'll be to an Ish Zor. The bar Havaya in somebody who can she could be with Havaya, meaning the wedding works. The La Bar Havaya Loi, somebody who she can't stay with, who will go. Will not make her puzzle for meeting Juma Kamash. Well, on the puzzle, we say it's puzzle. With Rabbi Yochanan, Adam Rabbi Yochanan, I'm sure Rabbi Shmuel, when I live, come the Eved Shabo Ala Kehenes Ala Leviyah. So how do you know? How do you know that a guy that's that's boil any girl Shapaslua that makes her puzzle? Shenem or a Baskayin to see Almana Grusha a Baskayin when she'll be on Almana Grusha. Mishi Eshel Almana Sugerishin Ba somebody. Who has the possibility of becoming a, a an Alman and a Grusha from, right? Then she's allowed to go back to her father's house. Meaning, if she was married to Yisrael, so she can't eat truma. If she gets divorced, if she gets divorced or she becomes a widow, she can go back to her father's house and eat truma, right? But we're saying that's only from somebody who she could become a Grusha and an Alman from Yatsu. That excludes an Avikhaven and Evid that. She cannot become an almana and grusha because she's not allowed to be married to them. Therefore, if she sleeps with an almana or she sleeps with a guy, then she's automatically puzzled from truma. So that's pashit. Okay. So now, bottom line is, is we still have a mission that says that there's no kinoi for somebody who's not an ish. So what is it coming to exclude? So now again, we get wild gemaras here. So I'm rapapa lamute behema, deins nos behema. It comes, it comes to if the husband's jealous that his wife is sleeping with an animal, right? He's the husband says, "Hey, you're hanging, honey, you're hanging out with the animal for too long, right? I'm jealous." Right? So he and warns then, her, he warns her not to be to be with an animal. Yeah, that's how else how else is it going down? Yes, well, I, I don't know. I can't, can't exactly sure. warn the animal. <laughs> right, I would say yeah. Even though there's no Isra Yichu with an animal, though. So that's a Raya Akiva. And she, say, and she doesn't listen to this, and she continues. Um, yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's okay. what I'm saying. It's coming I, to a I understand. Behem. <laughs> you got to love that marriage, right? The Ain's Nus the Behema. There's no such thing as Nus the Behema, which Tyson has already asked from the sheet in Yavamas that says that there is Nus with the Behema. It's considered Nus, meaning we had this in Yavamas. Parrots, I think we had this by your, uh, by your Vart. I think we learned this, this sugya. I don't know what parrots is. Yeah, but... it has to do with a thorn, with a guy with the Kayin Gadol. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Gadol, right? it's it's like he's allowed to marry. Yeah. I, don't, I did not participate in the daf by my heart. Well, maybe you should go back to the video and listen. <laughs> uh, <what else? laughs> but uh, I think it was by your folks. I remember we were sitting in the Sikhits of Pismerish when we were discussing this, right? Whether there's nus for, for a behemoth, right? So we're saying that there's no nus for behemoth. Right. Okay. Well, let's just get to the bottom. I'm sorry, it's late. So Amar le Rav Rav mi parzika mi parzakia le Rav Ashi mi no hamil so Dama Rabbanon. Why do we know this thing that the Rabbanon said aids nus be behema? How do you know that there's no such thing as nus be behema? Meaning, if a woman, bottom line is, a woman is chayim misa if she sleeps with an animal, but she could stay with her husband, right? She can stay with her husband, right? Even though she's oy chayim misa. So the chiv like savi esnan zayin. So wait, is he warning her not to be miyachet with her? Or is he warning her that he's, she's chayv misa? Both, both. Okay, both. 
Okay. Depends how from he is. I don't know. Depends, <laughs> Depends if he knows <laughs> the halacha. <laughs> yeah. So, so nobody, you're not allowed to take money from a zaina and use that money for the base of Mikdash. And if you sell a dog, you can't use that either, that money for the base of Mikdash. But Tanya, Esnan Kelev, Umechir Zaina, but <laughs> this is also an interesting thing. If you hire, if you hire, as it say, Esnan Kelev, if you give a uh, go now, if you, if you, right, if, you pay, if, you pay, if you pay a woman to be Mazana with, with your dog or a dog, that, that money could go to the base of Mikdash. Right? Umechir Zaina. And if you take, if you swap a zaina for an animal, that animal, you could also go to the base of Mikdash. Meaning it's only money for znus and money from a dog that you can't give to the base of Mikdash. But for znus with a dog and an animal for a zaina, that you're allowed to do. To swap it out, you're allowed to do. Mutar and shenem or gam shneem, both of them, right? Shneem v'loy arba, meaning two of them is an issue, four is not an issue. So only two things is an issue, the Esnan Zaino and the Mechir Kelev. Okay, fine. So now, so now we're good. So we're talking about that if the husband's jealous that she's together with an animal, so then there's no Kinu and Stira in that. Okay, so what's with the Sheikh Zerah, the Pasuk of Sheikh Zerah? Right? Why does it say that there has to be the requirement of Sheikh Zerah? Well, the Sheikh Zerah, Lama Limbi, Ba'ilai, look at the Tani, Sheikh Zerah, Prada Dover Acher. That's coming to exclude Dover Acher. What does that mean? My Dabar Acher, so Amar Rav Sheish is Prat, Prat, L'Shakina uh, L'Shaloi Kedarka. He, this husband, was very involved in what this woman was doing. So he was Makana her not to have Bia Shaloi Kedarka with this guy. Not regular standard Bia, he wasn't worried about that. He was worried about Bia Shaloi Kedarka. Right? Um, meaning if he only warned her that she shouldn't have be a shalaika darka with this guy, that's not a kinu. Right? Samale Rava, shalaika darka, mishkave isha. What do you mean? It says mishkave isha, plural, different types of being together with a woman. So why wouldn't a kinu, a warning her about be a shalaika darka, count? Okay. Salah so, Marava, pratle, shakina la derech varim. Right? That's where he was makana her. And this is a common thing, unfortunately. This is what happens with Manazeh, because they're educated, right? Where he was Makana her only Derech Evarim, right? Meaning he says to her, stop going to with this guy. She says, I'm not Mazana with him. He says, I don't even want you to be intimate with him or have be a Derech Evarim, meaning not in the Isa Makam, which will not make her Asa, which is what all these smart people, God, I'm going to call them smart, whatever, do when they're Mazana with the white, with this, with an Ashish Ish. So what they do is they do everything except for the beer, right? So if the husband, if the husband hops onto this and warns and says, don't do that, that's not a kino. That's not a kino. That's what Gemara is saying. Yeah. So I'm <laughs> That Lushan can really, it's, pre, it's only pritzus. It's only pritzus, right? Right? Pritzus of me, Asa Rahmana. Pritzus of Alma. I know <laughs> it's Pritzusa <laughs> Baal. Right? No, it's Ayo Pritzusa Miyasa Rahmana. Did the Torah ask for Pritzus? I mean, if you if this line, line if you did, <laughs> oh, you put you should put that on a tattoo. That's a good thing for a tattoo. <laughs> and then if this this if this line uh, if this line gets into uh, to somebody the wrong, it will Pritzusa Miyasa Rahmana. Did the Torah ask for Pritzus? Right? So, okay. But the point is, I mean, what's your Chiddush? You don't need a Chiddush to tell you that she's not also to her husband if they were only in Pritzus Abama. Rashi says Pritzus Abama is that they lay, lay with each other, the Kira bus. So again, so it can't be, it can't be that the Chiddush is, is that if he was jealous of her just touching a guy, that that would, be, that would botch the marriage, because it doesn't. Okay, so El Amar Abayah, Pratla Shekinah Lop and Neshikah. He was Makana her that he said, don't have Nashika, meaning Nashika normally means a kiss, but it doesn't mean a kiss here because that's the, the, that was the previous one. We're talking about where the where the Aver just touches the Isamakum, nothing more than that. Right? So then he told her not to have that. So Gemara says, 
That works according to the mind that says hara. Hara means just a partial, partial penetration. So if you say hara means achnosas atara, the crown of the aver, so then okay, this is not, this is not that, right? I'm on the shika of aloy klumi, but if the one that says that hara is just nishika, just touching, and that's it, hainu dasi kralam ute nishika, and that's what the pasuk is coming to exclude to the to exclude nishika. Can't be. What, what are you going to say with the sheet that says haraz just where it touches and that's it? Then they're also to each other. Meaning, if you go with the sheet that says haraz is at least a partial, the top of the aver, okay, so then this is a different category. But according to the Mandomer, it says that once the aver touches the Isamakam, that's considered hara, so then, then, then that's a regular bia. So the Gemara answers, No, really, he was Makanar, he said, Derech Ivarim, don't, I don't want you touching this fellow, even if you're not going to be Mezana. Umao, the same, maybe you would think that the whole thing is totally in the Hakpada of the Baal. Meaning, even if halachically, she will not become Asr to him, but if it, if it ticks off the Baal, then maybe that's enough to make Kina and Stira. Ubal Hakapit, and the Baal is Makpit. The, the Gemara is telling us, no, he only has a right to be Makana her if it's going to make her usher to him, but he cannot be Makana her if it's not going to make her usher to him, which is a wild, wild shot. That means the husband has no right to have Tainas on his wife. I mean, he could have Tainas, but not enough, not enough necessarily to initiate a divorce. L'choyr. At least not. Well, it's not enough for, for Hashka. It's not enough for drinking. I'm not sure. Is this right. enough to, 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 is this enough for a divorce? L'chair it should be. Yeah, why not? I, I don't know. From here it's mashma that the drinking and shasia and kinoi go together. But divorce and the drinking go together. No, because the drinking is to find out. No, but, no, no. But will she give, still get the ksuba? Will she get the ksuba? No, oh, she's my redness. Why is she Meredith? She's, she's been with him. Which one? Like the Gemara's Maskan. It wouldn't be Meredith? Uh, is it? I have no idea. I mean... Uh, I don't know either. I would have thought okay. so. Okay, it's late already. I'm sorry for the whole overtime, but uh, it was one of those daft. What should he do? Okay. The right. should have themselves a oh, fine... Parrots. Is Parrots and, still uh, on? We still get to up. start tomorrow with a bang. Well, I'm until, still here, Gersh, maybe I should mute yeah. you now for tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Gersh has got to be that guy to ask the bomb caster right at the end of this year, Gersh. <laughs> hey, I didn't. <laughs> uh, <yeah. laughs> All right. I'm not really that much to blame tonight, am I? No, 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 no. No, no. I'm just happy for the last part. I went to my basement. <laughs> I was wondering, Parrot, did you go hide in your basement on purpose? <laughs> yeah, well, kind of. Killed two birds with one stone, but it could have gotten any better timing than that. Tanya, uh, uh, Jacob, I, I had Simka sitting here in the beginning. I threw him out of here so fast. <laughs> well, the well, beginning of the days? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Red Siyako, with the yeah the conversation you mentioned before with the um uh, the single girls in Passaic who who uh, yeah. uh again pregnant by VF. So I, I had a couple of years. Are we still recording? Yeah. Oh, should we shut Barrett? We gotta stop the recording. Right, Shyla coming. <laughs> <laughs> Shyla, uh... Take your face off, that's all. <laughs> Nobody will know. No. Okay, we know no, I... Gershon, Gershon, go ahead, say to Shyla, Gershon. Go ahead, now say it. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, it's not a Shaila. I had a conversation a couple of years ago with uh, Shai Shaster. He's, he's oh, very yeah. involved in these. He's very involved in these issues. He said, he said that he has these these single girls that are their mom crying to him. He said they they can't get married. They're getting older already. They all froze their eggs already. He said they want to have kids. He said he 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 felt very very. Um, very strongly that they should be able to. He said he doesn't know why there's any if there with it. He said he went around to Rabbanim, but he said nobody wanted to go ahead and give any support. Nobody was wanted to be the one to go ahead and uh, he, he didn't blame them, but he said nobody wants to uh, 
You were mentioning that things change with the times. Or, or well, then no one wanted to let them have kids or freeze their eggs. N- no. no, freezing eggs wasn't a problem. No one wanted to sort of like take a price and say and, and like be the first one to say it's okay to go ahead and, uh, and, and allow them to do that. No, there are Rabbanim in Eretz Yisrael that are allowing it. Uh, he must know. He must know about it. This was like uh, I don't know, a few years ago. Maybe it changed since then. But uh, he said he had a hard time getting any support from any Rabbanim. So who Listen, in Eretz Yisrael? I don't know who the names are. I'm sure you go search and go on one of your chats. Is he quitting? His father wasn't uh, uh, amenable to it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if he asked his father. I'm not sure. Where was his father in all this? Yitzi. It's, a, it's very hard to find a rub to even allow a married couple to use a geyser. In the, in the right. yeshiva circles, with meaning to be Samahara Maisha. Right. But no go. It's a no go. Yeah. If Paris was shot the recording, I can give you names, but. but uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> not.